Hi, this is Thresden, and this is the final part of the ESO High Isle walkthrough. In this episode, I'm going to do the trial. Let me see if I can find it here. So there was a trial that was released when this came out. It's called Dreadsail Reef, and there's a quest associated with it. Uh, let's see if I can find it. I don't have it. Oh, I must have finished the quest in an earlier episode. Uh, let's see. I'm just going to go over there. <coughs> and we're off! <coughs> I'm going to go over there and see if I can find the quest. If the quest appears, then that means I didn't do it. But if it doesn't appear, it means that... I already did the quest, which it looks like I did. Okay, so all I need to do is to find the boat to Dreadsail Reef, and I'll pick up the weekly quest from there. That's Amino Station. That's not what we want. Well, I shouldn't have finished the quest, because now I don't know how to get there. I think it's a boat that's over here. What is this? It doesn't tell me. Okay, I don't know how to get there, so I'm just going to teleport in. Yeah, I must have explored the entryway to Dreadsail Reef Attention, in a previous Marine. episode. There's fighting to be done. Let me have a look at you, Marine. Hmm. Yes, you'll make a fine addition to the assault force. We only have time to land a few of you, so every fighter we send has to count for ten. What is our objective? The death or capture of Taleria, the fleet queen of the Dreadsail Pirates. She's the linchpin holding those bloodthirsty sea elves together and the greatest obstacle standing between our navy and the elimination of these pirates. What's the plan? Once the Dufort Flotilla has engaged the Dreadsail fleet, this vessel will take you within striking distance of their island base. Make landfall, find Talaria, and subdue her before she can bring her magic to bear on our ships. Understood. We'll be engaging the enemy momentarily. Prepare as you need and get on deck. This ship will be a sitting duck until you're underway, so make it quick. What can you tell me about the Fleet Queen? She's the scourge of the Sisters Archipelago. One of the Sea Elves' most powerful conjurers. A Sea Mage. Her storms have sunk many a warship in pursuit of her fleet. But we hope cornering her on land may tip the scales in our favor. Is she really that dangerous? I've had the misfortune of clashing with her fleet on many occasions. We've lost more ships to her waves and gales than to honest warfare. The only way this attack stands any chance of success is if you stop her. Do you have the lay of the Dreadsail Reef? We've only spied it from afar. It's a craggy rock full of tunnels that these wharf rats have turned into a warren. We'll get you as close as we can, but the shallows are full of jagged rocks and coral waiting to take a bite of our hull. Any other threats I should be aware of? Our flotilla will do its best to draw the Sea Elves' attention, but you should expect scores of pirates to stand between you and the Fleet Queen. They'll also have trained sea beasts at their beck and call. Victory will be hard won. All right, how did the Dreadsails get so entrenched in your waters? They've been a nuisance for years. But the losses suffered going after them always outweighed the benefits of victory. That changed in recent months. The Dreadsails have been striking waterways all over the Sisters in small, well-coordinated groups. So they're being more aggressive? Aye. Teleria has split her fleet into small attack groups to hit as many shipping lanes as she can. We've tried to catch them out in smaller numbers, but their groups maneuver in perfect concert with each other. Okay. I'll get a group together and attack.
Um, so I'm gonna need to leave the instance. And then I'll go to Craglorn and find a group. Well, that's interesting. It, I thought for a minute it dropped you off outside of wherever the boat is, but I realize it, when you leave it just drops you off wherever you were before you teleported. So, that doesn't mean anything. Okay, I need to go to Craglorn and find a group. Alright, I'm going to stop the video right here and I'll pick it back up once I get a group. Alright, we got the group together. We've got, uh, let's see, we've got Aiko, Bellerfear, Brand the Broken One, Denera, Phoebe Laraud, Sinjin, Sugarface, me and Zuxar on DPS. And then we've only got one tank named Maybe Not a Tank. And then we got two healers. Funny Names Get Banned and Sir Inod. Okay, I am heading to the instance. By the way, I have no idea how to run this trial. Sail reef is just a but I think our tank does, <laughs> so we should be okay. <laughs> uh, we only have one tank. The, uh, the tank insisted that he can solo this. He just kept saying, we absolutely do not need a second tank. <laughs> Pi reminder, what does that mean? I'll go ahead and eat just to make sure. Alright, I'm ready whenever they are. I have no idea how to run this trial. Never run it. I've never even watched a video of people running this trial, so I have no clue. I've got a nasty bit of business for you. Standing in bad. internet connection is not very good right now and I'm seeing an extremely blurry screen but I'm sure it looks good on your end so that makes me happy but it's it makes it kind of hard to fight when I just see a bunch of like pixelation You 
you've not watched any of my videos before, I use uh, Shadow Gaming to play. So, sometimes I get pixelated images. Sometimes I get input lag. But, I record all of the videos. Um, on the remote PC, so that's why it always looks good on your end. But you may be hearing my microphone be distorted because obviously I can't teleport myself to where the remote computer is, so that's going through the internet. What have we got here? An audience? Fresh challengers, more like. Shame the usual this is the first crowd boss. is here to watch us slaughter them. Their screams will have to substitute for cheering. Let's put on a show! Alright, we got some flame hounds in front of us. If you can't manage this, we won't bother getting up. Down, Turley. It warms me to feel needed. Yeah, it does end now, because we're gonna kill you. Whoa. Fire tornadoes. How dare you tap into my power? Early, what are you getting on the action? <sighs> I'm always cleaning up after you, lie. Uh, we're only at 69%. Still got a long ways to go. I'm sure, this is gonna get harder as time goes on. Ha! How do you like my ice sculpture? Enough! Tie an anchor to these vermin, lie. Of course. Are you only? You don't look to be faring any better than I did. Let's Something was hitting me. Action, like. Oh man. <sighs> You'll go up like Tinder now. Uh, don't even have my bear summoned. Come on. I can't that summon my bear for some reason. There it goes. Oh, man. This is embarrassing. At least we go. Together. <gasps> this is defeat. I hate it. All right, one boss down, two or three to go. Shame I can't host you longer, but I've got some full sailors to 
Last round. This isn't too hard so far. I tried to go in that thing, I thought it was gonna launch me upwards, but it didn't. Here go. Uh oh. I didn't mean to pull the bobs! sure what the point of that was. Seems kind of like a dead end. <laughs> Maybe we had to do that to get it to open? Okay, so you have to hit X when you go into these things right here. Well, that didn't do any good. <laughs> There's no point. In a small box now. Who would you choke it? Need people on levers, he said. What levers? There's other levers, I guess? We have to pull all of them at once? Okay, here we go. This is confusing.
look out for that beam that hits. I imagine that thing will probably one-shot me if it hits me. Just from the look of it. What in the world? Chest on tank, if needed. Um, wait, so there's a chest over here? Yeah, okay. What in the world is that green stuff on me? It's not damaging me. Okay, somebody needs to get the lever, I guess. I wonder how long this green stuff is going to be on me. Here we go. Looks like the second boss. I'm trying not to stand in bad, but there's so much bad on the ground that it's hard not to. Took out the second boss. Our guardian hides its red heart in the cavernous depths in the dark. Then flies into what the hell? They're just hanging out in that ruin. This is neutral ground. I aim to respect that, even if you weren't invited by the Queen. No fighting, no problem. Okay, I guess uh, I'll accept that truce. Oh, there's loot in here. Okay. I wouldn't say I like dealing with Maoma, but the Fleet Queen has big plans for the sisters, and I don't want to be left behind. Okay. Oh, here's the chest that they were just talking about in chat. What's this? I thought maybe it was some gear. It looks like a battle axe. Okay, I'll take it. Alright, where is everybody? They're all running ahead of me now.
Wait, how do I get through the door? This way? How come it let the other person through the door, but not... Oh. They somehow pulled both levers at the same time. Lightning. been turned into a tiny person. What the hell? Alright, I'm back to regular size now. That was crazy. to count down that everybody pulls the switch at the same time. That's how they're getting the doors open. Oh, uh, still more electricity? Man. Watch out for those tornadoes. Those things hurt. See what I mean? I guess if I get in the middle, it doesn't hurt. I need to get over here with the rest of the group so the healer can reach me.
Resurrection pending, okay. Alright, we're going into Coral Cavern. Don't stand behind me, okay? Um, who is our tank again? Maybe not a tank. Right, really obvious. None of those useless louts managed to stop you. Oh, he's got a well, marker I on him now. Okay, Let's good. See how good you really are. No, don't send us another. We don't want another. I don't see an enemy anywhere. I just see electricity. What is going on? Is it bugged out? Uh, he says we have to wait 20 seconds. It said you failed to destroy a reef heart. What do we do now? I mean, it says he has 6.4% health left. You can't jump from the center hole, he said. I don't know what we're doing. Oh, now he's finally, now we can finally hit him. now, and you might still escape what I unleash. What's this? Another chest. Pearlescent sabatons.
testing. Okay, just make sure my audio is working. I was worried there for a minute. Somebody just wasted their ultimate right after the battle was over. <laughs> Called down a storm atronaut. Got a recipe for red guard venison pie. That was the guy that was doing the fire breath. Figured we needed to take him out quick.
I assume there's only one more boss to this. Um, because I think we've killed three of them. Oh, I, that was a lore book I didn't have. Delay these bastards! It's time I end this! Look at this floor. Another one. Another lore book I didn't have. Another chest. Ah, uh, simple chest. Okay. But I won't become good. All right, here we go. Let me show you the power that's going to crush that little flotilla of yours. Here comes Fleet Queen Teleria. My power is as lost as the sea itself. Tideborn Teleria. She turned into some Tideborn creature. Apparently. Some things you need to know. And I can't see it. When you got bubble on you... I can't read what it says below it. Because my screen is so pixelated. When you got bubble on you... Let's see if I can up my resolution. You got bubble on you. Nah, I still can't see anything. I don't know why it's so pixelated. Uh, maybe it takes a minute to adapt. Keep moving when there's tornado. When you got bubble on you, swim behind. Yeah, here it goes. Now I can see. Um, you can't control yourself. Sure, or... All right, I'm going to switch back to auto-detect now so that I don't end up having input lag. Kill Siren when rotating. Okay, so like right now... Oh, man. I probably messed something up. Watch what everybody else is doing. Now, this looks bad. Oh no! Oh, shit. It had that red line around it. I thought. Yeah. Can you hear the sea beckoning? A sultry, seductive melody. Okay, so this is significantly more difficult.
Well, I can't use one of my abilities because it'll make you jump into the lake. Looks like I'm down one ability. So I guess I need to stay here. Oh, I actually can use it. It doesn't throw me into the lake. All right. I guess you just have to, the healer has to heal through it. I was trying to avoid a lot of these mechanics, but you can't avoid them. You'll just die if you try. See, like, right there. The only reason I survived that because I was right up where the healer was. You're this landing. It's time to bring the landing force home. What's your report? Alright. My battle mages have been waiting for the magic to calm around this damned island. We were getting tossed about on choppy seas until you took the wind out of her sails. Where's Teleria? She transformed into that coral monstrosity, but we defeated her. That's a trick the Sea Witch never shared with me. Thank the Divines. Wasn't enough to spare her from you, though. I'm not sure what scares me more. Glad you were on our side, Marine. Let's get you <laughs> home and to the purser. All right. Pack it in! We can scour the island once the rest of the Dreadsail fleet lines the ocean floor. Alright, I got the Tideborn Teleria Trophy. And let's see here. Teleria Sundry Treasure. We got a crafting motif. Cerebonic Marine Chess. And we got a Pearlescent Ring, part of the Pearle Pearlescent Ward set. Some Transmute Crystals. Alright, I assume that outfit style is all... What was it? Cerebonic? Uh... No! I want the Cerebonic S-Y-R. Here we go. Alright, let's see what the medium gear looks like. So, if we get the whole set... This is what we got now, is this chess piece. But if we get the whole set... It'll look like... Oh, good! I was so bored. This pretty cool outfit set. I'm sure it would take like a hundred runs to get the complete set. All right, let's see what else we got. Um, any other gear? We got the pearlescent ring. Pillager's Gloves, Pearlescent Sabatons, and these of all... Well, this one we need to bind. Jerk into the depths. And I think that's it. So, look at the collections tab. Here, it should show me now. What's this? Collectibles, furnishings. I got the new uh, trophy. Where's that at? 
right here. Tideborn Teleria Trophy. I'll put that in my house in just a minute. And then I've got this gear. Coral Riptide Arm Cops. Pearlescent Ring. Robe of the Depths. Uh, it looks like a pretty good DPS set right there. Rope of the Depths. Alright, so now I'm going to go to my house. Alright, let's go to my house and put this trophy up. No, not Antiquarian's Alpine Gallery. I want to go to Matheson Manor. Well, everybody was thanking each other, but uh, unfortunately, I was finishing the quest and all that kind of stuff. Thanks for the group, guys. Alright, let's see here. Um... Yeah, I think it's time to start on this part of the wall. Why is this not working? Here it goes. Yeah! Tideborn Teleria. Here we go. Try to make it so there's not a space in between it, but it always puts a space there. All right, so we got a new trophy, new piece of an outfit style, and that's it. We're completely finished with High Isle. I'm going to take a little bit of a break now, probably for the next few weeks until the new, um, until the new prologue quest comes out. But keep an eye out for that. Thanks for watching. See you next time.